you will definitely love this amazing question with very interesting solution so here given to us is a triangle with a point randomly selected inside it now we have to select two more points on these two side lengths let's say those points are point b and point c now with these three points we can form a triangle here if those points are b dash and c dash a different triangle will be formed and if it's b double dash and c double dash a third triangle can be formed so like this with one point on the left side and another on the right side we can form infinite many triangles now the question is to find the triangle which will have minimum perimeter among these infinite many triangles in other words we have to find the location of point b and point c on these two side lengths so that the triangle formed will have minimum perimeter let's check this amazing solution for that we are starting with a random triangle here and we are treating this side length of the triangle as a mirror so first we have to draw mirror image of point a across this mirror for that we are drawing a perpendicular line and taking the distance equally on the left and on the right side so a dash is mirror image of point a as it's a mirror image so if this distance is x centimeter then distance of this point to the mirror image will also be x centimeter same way let's treat the second side length of the triangle as a mirror and draw mirror image of point a across it so a double dash is the mirror image now if this side length of the triangle is y centimeter then the distance of this point from the mirror image will also be y centimeter now let's call this length the third side length of this red triangle as z centimeter if you notice the perimeter of this triangle formed is same as the distance between these two mirror image points so this distance of mirror image points and the perimeter of this triangle is same so this is true for other triangles formed also let's take two more points on this side lengths and now this triangle formed this triangle perimeter will be same as the pathway from a double dash till a dash so this pathway length and the perimeter of green triangle is same let's take two more points here on the top now the perimeter of this triangle which is getting formed here the perimeter will be same as the pathway from a double dash till this vertex along the side length and to a dash so all the possible triangles formed inside this blue triangle their perimeter will be same as the different pathway you can take from a double dash till a dash and the shortest pathway which you can take is of course the straight line from a double dash till a dash and that will be the minimum perimeter of the triangle which will be formed and this line is passing through these two points here point b and point c so in fact point b and point c will be the two other vertex of the triangle so this triangle acb is the required perimeter which will have minimum possible perimeter and that's our answer i hope you enjoyed the solution i will see you in next video till then tata bye bye